Well, since reports of the book being banned in schools, the Education Ministry has appeared to row back from that position, saying the book had not been disqualified, but merely not included among the books studied in the high school programme. Border Life's writer Dorit Rabinian joins us now live from Tel Aviv, and I should warn you there is awful delay on the line. Um, Dorit Rabinian, um, this feels like possibly an autobiographical experience, or is it actually a response to the so social and societal changes in Israel? I'm using autobiographical details to emphasize a fiction artwork in every book I write. It's the experience that I'm using to inflame my imagination. And it took me six years to write this novel it's uh, power, it's for being delicate and for being precise, for being gentle. I never thought this work of mine would ever provoke such a scandal. This is not a scandal material, do you, uh, as sort of, it happened to be. Do you understand the misgivings that the authorities have, given that in the end the Jewish state is about preserving the Jewish race as much as any other issue? I mean, that that it was about the survival of, Ju uh, of Jewry that Israel was founded. Our DNA uh, surviving for 2,000 years in the diaspora is based on preserving our identification by um, uh, preserve preserving the race and being a uh, sovereignty now, having our own state, we're free and privileged to have uh, freedom above all the privileges that we have having a state and having our own um, regime. So in a sense, does... society, language... Yeah. In a sense, does your religion. book... Religion. But book... We, leave, we, leave, we live yeah. in a neighborhood. This neighborhood is... is, is yeah. Does your book, therefore, in a way, justify... Sorry. <laughs> the, d d does it justify the issue of intermarriage? After all, there are only 20 intermarriages a year in Israel. Uh, the, the, my motivation writing books, writing novels, is never uh, intend to justify or promote or have an, a hidden agenda as I was suspected to have. I'm a storyteller. I write um, the, the experience of being a human being. And I, I, never, found, I never aimed to uh, justify or um, pr maybe promote any idea except for the story itself. What a reader would find in it, it is on his own responsibility. Dorit Rabinian, thank you very much indeed for joining us. Thank you very much.